Om Shanti, welcome back. Now we are here with the 17th of August Godly Blessing. Now God wants us to be cheerful and carefree all the time and He wants us to experience victory. Now see, cheerfulness and carefree, this is what makes us victorious. It's not about carelessness, it's about being carefree. So God says, may you be constantly cheerful and carefree and experience victory on the basis of having unbreakable faith. Now, this is a little difficult for the beginners, but those who have experienced victory, small, small victories, can think about bigger victories. But it has to start somewhere, right? So it's about faith. So let's understand this. God says the sign of having faith is to become victorious easily in every situation with your thoughts, words, actions, relationships, and connections. Where there is unbroken faith, the destiny of victory cannot be prevented. Now provided the karma which you are doing is beneficial for everybody else. It's not something which you are doing where it's going to harm somebody. Now we are talking about selfless karma and also talking about doing it for self. But we are not talking about a karma where you are hurting somebody, bringing somebody down or making sure that somebody else doesn't become victorious in your place. So we are talking about a pure karma over here where the faith will sustain because faith needs a foundation of good karmas. So then God says where there is unbroken faith, the destiny of victory cannot be prevented. Only those whose intellects have such faith can be constantly cheerful. It depends upon your karma, by the way. First condition. Second is you have faith that whatsoever you're doing, others are going to benefit out of it. God then says to ask the question of why it happened, what happened, how it's happening for any situation is a sign of worry. Why? What? How? The slogan of a soul whose intellect has faith and is carefree is whatever happened was good, is good and will be good. Now there's some learning out of it. There's some understanding out of it. Even people who have gone to jail for certain work which they were doing great work they understood that our karma is for a good reason and the jail is also going to bring about something good i don't want to take names of people over here but certain people have grown spiritually in the jail certain people have grown spiritually when they were put aside when they were sent away far away when they were not allowed to even enter the cities enter their homes enter the countries but they have grown as a wiser person more mature a person so everything is happening for the good in any kind of situation. They will experience goodness in even something bad because nothing actually is bad. Everything has got certain amount of learning. See, I'm over here with the spiritual knowledge because of certain things which I have experienced in my life. If I didn't have this knowledge or when I didn't have this knowledge, I would say those situations were really bad. But after receiving this knowledge, I understand that those situations were important for me to have a realization which I'm having now. If I didn't go through all those situations, all those troubles, all those bad situations, which I can go right now also through. But those situations have brought me till here. So I am blessed or I was blessed to actually have those situations because of which I'm over here. But that is something which we need to have a faith in that everything is happening for the good, everything has happened for the good and everything will happen for the good. Because there is something which I cannot see right now is going to come forth through this situation. Then God says they will, they will be ignorant of the word worry. Why? When? What? How? And this is what we need to achieve through spirituality and this is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris through soul consciousness. You too can learn this beautiful knowledge and become waste free, become worry free and be free from why, when, what, how. The main questions which are troubling everybody and even leading to diseases of the mind like depression, stress, sleeplessness. So if you want to get rid of this, these questions of why, when, what, how, then Brahma Kumaris is the right place for you. With this, Om Shanti.